Hi, my name is Larry Jordan, and this is an excerpt of a recent Power Up webinar taking a look at how to repair still images in Photoshop CC. In this excerpt, I'll show you how to use the healing brush. For you sports enthusiasts, this is golf from 1910. Catalina Island. I love the hat on the caddy. It's just amazing. We got a number of problems here. First is we've got a levels issue. Second, we've got a scratch there. We've got a bad fold. We've got missing elements here. And we got this bad mark on the edge of her dress down to here. This is, it's a mess. So how are we going to fix it? We're going to work with a new tool called the healing brush, the spot healing brush. Again, like with the clone tool, you want to make sure that the healing brush is bigger than that which you want to fix. I just used the right square bracket. Start clean and drag over the area you want to clean up. When you let go, it's gone. Is that magical or what? Look at that. Now here, I want to get rid of this big fold, so I'm going to make it a little bit bigger to get rid of the fold. Okay, I don't want to go into the white, and I don't want to get on his jacket, so I'll go a little bit bigger. But you start where there's a textural dividing line. See the difference between the hill near and the hill far? I'm going to start there and drag up. And I'm going to start down here and drag down. And what the healing brush does is it blends pixels from either side of the area that you're trying to clean up and makes it disappear. Is that not cool or what? Now, let's just zoom in a bit here. I've got this tear. I'm going to start here. Now, here's a very interesting thing that changed inside Photoshop since last I used this process. I'm going to drag down into the white. And notice Photoshop retains that sharp edge, but earlier versions of Photoshop would not. What would happen is I would drag up from here, and the white would smear up. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to clean this crease up here by going to the Marquee tool and drag and put the Marquee right on the edge so that it excludes the white. Now when I do the Healing Brush and drag into the Marquee, it does not heal above it. It only heals inside the selected area. So I can now drag out here. Nothing happens except inside the healing brush. Okay. Now, let's get even more carried away. Let's go to the Marquee tool. First, let's go to our healing brush here. Deselect. Let's draw the Marquee tool out. Let's just use the healing brush and pull this down. Good. Now, with the Marquee tool, we're going to get rid of this area right here. And I'm going to select. He's, this is his golf club. It ends right there. So I'm going to select out. I'm going to hold the Option key down and drag out the area representing his golf club right there. And what I did is I selected an area, held the Option key down, dragged inside that selected area, and the Option key excludes the part that you dragged in. Now I'm going to use the Clone tool first. A little bit bigger. There we go. And I'm going to clone, hold the Option key down from right about here, and move over. and get rid of that tear by just dragging across it and then use the healing brush smaller right about there gone what we just did is we used the clone tool to copy from over here over to here and then I use the healing brush to get rid of that tear like I did here. If we look at the picture again, all right, let's just do one more healing brush right there. Get rid of that. This has been an excerpt of a recent Power Up webinar taking a look at how to repair still images inside Photoshop CC. For the complete version of this online training, please visit our store at larryjordan.biz store and look for Webinar 150.
By the way, membership is a great value. If you need to stretch your training dollars, a subscription membership to our video training library saves you money. You can access all of our videos for a low monthly price of only $19.99. That's more than 1,200 movies, dozens of hours of training, all in-depth and all up-to-date. Plus, members can attend any of our Power Up webinars for free. Our training covers Apple and Adobe software. We update it every week. And for more information, visit LarryJordan.biz slash subscriptions. And thanks.